guys so it is day three of the tea and this is the first clip of the day it is currently 1 50 p.m 1 50 p.m why is this clip so late why didn't i do it in the morning well youtube that's why i was finished editing the video yesterday's video which went up this morning i put it to upload on youtube overnight and i fell asleep and I woke up at 5 in the morning because I really had to pee really bad. And when I woke up and I went to the bathroom and I came back to bed half asleep, I saw that YouTube rejected the video. And it was because it was 19 minutes long and I had to enable the, nine, you know, over 15 minute video. I did that half asleep and then I left it uploading. I woke up at 9. I woke up at 9 something a.m. Got up was finalizing all of the video things and everything and then I went ahead and went to have breakfast, went to have the tea. I couldn't video it because I'm videoing this on my phone and my video was uploading on the phone at the time. I'm just gonna show you what I had for breakfast and all that stuff because it's never too late. Breakfast, you can't really see it because it's in my stomach right now. <laughs> I had this banana bread like little biscuit thing. It's no artificial flavors, colors, preservatives, things like that. It's healthy and it's a nice good boost so of energy. They're about this big this big and I am drinking my smoothie still and it looks really gross but it I promise yeah, you it's, it's spinach not. strawberries blackberries blueberries oatmeal soy milk chia seeds and my vegan protein I mean my first job was at a smoothie bar so I have a bunch of recipes programmed in here of the ones that I used to make at the smoothie bar and they're so delicious so thumbs up the video if you guys would like me to make a video on smoothies or breakfast ideas. I was drinking the smoothie, I was actually drinking the tea, so when I did it a little differently, instead of waiting till I was done having breakfast, which was the biscuit and the smoothie, I was just drinking it as if I was drinking water here and there. This and morning, and before I could even eat breakfast or get something in my tummy, I went to the bathroom. And you know why I went to the bathroom. I guess you can look forward to going to the bathroom in the morning as soon as you wake up. If you go to school, if you go to work, that's good, I mean. You don't want to be at your desk or um, at work or whatever you do outside of your house needing to go take a shit. Like, that's the worst feeling also ever. Also woke up pretty sore. I'm sore only if I squeeze my muscles. I'm sore in my legs, my calves. Um, my ass is sore, but only if I squeeze it. <laughs> and what else is sore? My abs are a little tiny bit sore, but not really. And my arms and my shoulders are pretty sore, so I'm glad I woke up sore. Yes, give me a virtual high five. I also want to show you what I have for snacks during, like, just to hold me off after breakfast to lunch. Um, I'm going to show you what I have for snacks because I'm pretty sure you guys would like to know because, I mean, I have breakfast and then I have lunch and then I have dinner and I have nothing in between. That's kind of impossible. I like to eat and I get hungry pretty quick. So lately, it's been about a cup of these veggie chips. 30% less fat than the leading potato chips. They have no artificial flavors, colors, or preservatives, and they're vegan. So, woohoo! And they taste so freaking good. They're like an obsession. Those on these are 130 calories, but the fat is 7 grams, carb is 15, and protein is 1. Not that bad. They're non-GMO. They're certified kosher, zero trans fats, no artificial colors, flavors, or preservatives, zero cholesterol, and they're vegan. So these chips get an A plus for me, and they're really, really good. I'd have a banana, but I ran out of bananas, so I have to go get. I'd have a banana, I'd have an orange. I love those little halos, those little tangerines. Not tangerines, I like, well, are they tangerines? I do the same thing. I don't know. I think tangerines are more sour, I feel. Almost like towards a grapefruit. Anyways, that's what I have. Those are some snacks that I have. I'll see you guys later when I have lunch. Oh, yeah. And I forgot to mention, I did have the tea and I drank it all. And yeah. <laughs> so today for lunch, I'm having the same thing I had yesterday. I am just sauteing some potato on a pan. And I added a handful of spinach just so I can add it to the pasta later. This is so cool. It's my favorite part, adding the spinach, because you just get to see it wilt right before your eyes. Is wilt the right word? I think so. So this is the result. Hi guys, so I just wanted to check in with you guys real quick to just kind of update 
you. I just went to the bathroom to go pee and I was staring at myself for a couple minutes in the mirror and I realized not only do I look, but I feel less bloated and I feel actually really good. I feel like I've been working out and eating healthy for a while now and I just didn't start on Monday. So as of right now, I mean, it's de-bloating me. I don't know if that's a word, like I said, but de-bloating me, it, I think that's what it's so doing. Before I started this, I realized that I kept having like stomach pains and almost as, as if after every time I ate, my tummy would hurt and I haven't gotten a tummy ache today. So yes, yesterday I barely got a tummy ache. Today I didn't get a tummy ache and I didn't get dizzy like I've been. So that's good news. I'm hoping it's the tea. I'm pretty sure it's the tea because I mean, I only worked out once unless my body adjusts as quickly and I'm just like, yay. This is what I'm having for pre-workout. It's almost the same thing. Well, it's technically the same thing I had yesterday. Some Greek yogurt, some peanut butter, chia seeds, blueberries, blackberries, and one strawberry because I didn't want to waste the few strawberries that I have left. Excuse my ratchet nails and check out my so pajama guys, pants. I'm trying to work out and I'm going to work out in my room today, but there is a little butterfly in my room. I think it's a butterfly. It's like one of those little tiny um, ones that look like miniature butterflies. It's in my room flying everywhere, buzzing in my ear and all that stuff. And so I'm standing here in the dark. I turned off all the lights. I turned off the fairy lights. I turned on my room light and I turned on the hall light and I left my door. It's wide open because I'm waiting for the little fly to scram out through my door because they're attracted to light, aren't they? This little fucker is keeping me from working out yeah so that's my deal right now but i'm gonna work out i have my weights and i have my corset and i don't think my watch is gonna work i need to buy a new battery so that's what's happening right now i feel like i'm a spy and i'm spying on someone and i feel like this is a mission that i'm gonna win because i'm a determined girl and he's gonna get out of my room and not bug me at night because then we're gonna have problems. So I think it's gone. I'm gonna go ahead and work out. It is currently 8.55 p.m. <sighs> but let's go, let's do this. Let's go to work. Still alert though. I feel like Mr. Krabs in that episode of SpongeBob where he's like, so I'm like focused and better not pop out of me because pop a cap in its little butterfly butt. <laughs> you wanna You wanna You wanna hot body You wanna boot body You wanna muscle body You better work this You wanna run bikini Sit in martinis Look hot in a bikini You better work this Did you guys like that little workout video that I put for you guys <laughs> I have goals I wore my corset I got my workout done I feel great I'm in bed right now super duper sleepy I worked out I did arms my arms are gonna be so sore tomorrow that's all I know <sighs> I did, I think, six different type of workouts. Each of them were three sets of 10 reps, and they were weighted exercises with a little bit of cardio that I incorporated into them. I'm going back to how I used to work out a few years ago, maybe a year ago. I had my own routine and I create my own workouts and they were super successful. I was seeing results, so I'm gonna incorporate that with a T and just to, you know, if I was seeing results back then, maybe I'll see even more results now with the tea. So yeah, I'm drinking the tea and I'm about to go to bed, but I have to edit this video first. So I hope you guys have a nice night and this is it for now. For dinner, I had practically the same thing. Honestly, I'm a very boring, basic person when it comes to eating. Food for me isn't something that's like, oh my god i have to savor it i have to have something different for every meal no i see food as fuel and yeah so i had a tiny bit more pasta 
and some whole grain buns. So tomorrow I'll wake up and have a protein smoothie, protein antioxidant pack smoothie. So excited for that. Okay, I'm gonna go edit this video. Good night, and I hope you guys have a nice night or a nice morning or a nice evening or whatever time it is where you are. I love you guys. I'll see you tomorrow.